Welcome to this short video where I'm going to show you some quick tips for Cinema 4D. First, material replacement. Let's say you have a cloner object here. If you bake it and you don't have your cloner anymore. If you want to replace all the red objects with the blue material, you can either take the blue material, hold down the Alt key and drag it onto the red material. This will replace the red material by the blue one. Another method would be to right-click on the red material. Select Material Tags slash Objects. This way, it selects all the objects with the red material on it. And now you only need to drag the blue material in here. Second tips, let me show you how you can rig an arm. First go to the Character menu and select the Joint tool. Hold Ctrl and click to add bones. Make an angle to specify the orientation. If you want to change the position of one bone without affecting the others, you can hold the 7 key down while moving the bone. Now we have to attach the arm with the bones. Select the mesh and the bones. Go to the character menu and click on bind. The arm is now linked to the bones. Let's make an IK chain. For this we have to select the first and the last bones. Go to the character menu and click on create IK chain. It creates a null object that you can now move. Third tip, with the rigged arm. Most of the time you are going to get this issue where the arm is bent the wrong way. To fix that, we can use the delta mush object. So go to object, find the delta mush and hold down the shift key to put it on the arm. It's important to put it after the skin so it affects the arm. Here we can increase the iterations to have more bendiness. Smooth view here is to smooth the entire object. I keep the tangent mode on edge. Smooth type here I will choose fixed. This works better with a clean topology. If you have a mesh with a poor topology, the proportional option should be the best way. Next, I want to show you how you can add a new view panel. This can be helpful if you need to navigate into your scene without affecting the first view panel. Press Shift plus C to access the commander and type New View Panel. Double click, and you have your new view panel where you can navigate. Let's say you have a merged object and you want to select a specific part of it. To do so, go to the polygon mode here, then go to the select menu, fill selection. This way you can select the part of the object you want. Once it's done, right-click, split. You have now your new object. That's it for now. Don't hesitate to take a look at my other tutorials and time-lapses. See you in my next video.